said that Danny B and Killer Kid were going to get us started here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. I've got Shiva here with me and Brittany Howland as they're getting set up. The Diamonds Division is changing. The landscape continues to change as we now have a new champion, Promise Braxton, a two-time champion, looking possibly who could be a future number one contender here in Danny B. Lately, we have seen Danny B return to action here at the Reality of Wrestling in a uh, rather peculiar losing effort to Mia Friday. But she says that she's Rico, and we're going to be seeing Danny B return to action here tonight. making her reality of wrestling debut here tonight but this is not the first time she's been here in this building and it's not the first time she's been in the ring against Danny B. Brittany. Yes indeed this is actually the first one-on-one -on -one action however they have been in several triple threats four ways tag teams opposite and beside each other so they know each other very well but now the pressure is on one-on-one. -on -one. Now I'm going to give you the floor here, Shiva. You are the most experienced person here behind this commentary table being in the ring. What's it like being in the ring against somebody that you have no experience with in one-on-one -on -one action? No experience. It's definitely a bit of a surprise. You can't underestimate your opponent. But these two ladies, they know each other. They know what to expect. So they're going to have to pull something special out of the bag. And I can tell you right now, both of them are very technical wrestlers. And this is going to be definitely a showmanship right here. I know you definitely have your eyes closed on this matchup. As just a week ago, we crowned a new Diamonds Division champion in Promise Braxton. As the division is heating up, how are you feeling about getting back into the division here, Shiva? Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, as we see here, the roll up into the cover, but only oh, a two count. Ladies and gentlemen, we're having a little bit of technical difficulties here with Shiva's headset. We're going to make sure to get her back on the mic as soon as possible. But right now, Danny B in full control of this matchup as Killer Kate. Oh, look at this. She's going for the rear naked choke. She is the submission specialist for a reason. But Danny B was able to counter. She has her scouted as Killer Kate catches the leg. But once again, going in for that rear naked choke. And Danny B again able to get out of it. She can, but. And she's very dangerous with it. Don't underestimate her. She is, and oh, throwing Danny down, and I'm back oh. at it again. Like I said, do not under underestimate Killa Kate here. Well, she is a BJJ blue belt here, and that is an honor that is very hard to get be bestowed by anybody. And she is just making her grappling look easy here against Danny B. But she did have to get the rope break. Let's look at this once again. Charity oh King getting involved and creating a distraction. <gasps> Kate is going to have to have eyes in the back of her head here. As we said, these two women do know each other well, but there is the advantage oh, that Danny Char B has. Charity has. Oh, oh my gosh, she's just so puts to the outside. And that is the powerhouse, Charity Kane. Delivering that suplex on the outside as Danny B now going into the cover once again. One, two, but a kick out. You know, they do say teamwork makes the dream work, and we right here, perfect teamwork between Charity and Danny B. Now, what kind of pressure do you feel she might add when your opponent has somebody backing them up on the outside? Uh, I, I don't think Kate here really thought that this would end up being a triple threat. So I don't think she was prepared for that. So I, I, there's no, no oh, talent. Look at this. Oh, look this. Schoolboy roll up here. Shoulders are down. Two. But a kick out by Danny B. Now Danny B. She's just oh ground pounding her. Oh my goodness. I feel like Danny B may be having some flashbacks to uh, when she got uh, surprised by Mia Friday in her roll up. And the one, two, three. She doesn't want that to happen again. Well, see, now with the Diamonds Division title back, you know, I think uh, Danny B here feels like there's, she's got something to prove. That's what she, I mean, look at the intensity in her eyes. Well, we saw it work for Promise Braxton when she became a two-time Diamonds Division champion. She had to turn up the intensity. She had so much belief in herself. And maybe Danny B is trying to employ that kind of strategy for herself as she's just sending Killa Kate right into the corner with full force behind her. That is major pain. Oh my goodness. 
you don't really know what those feel like until you've been in the ring and experienced that for yourself. Definitely agree. Just look at this. Danny B in full control of this matchup. Charity Kane just clapping on the outside. Oh. But here comes Killa Kate. And the crowd is behind Killa Kate, though. Oh! Oh, oh it's Into holding cover here. Holding her down by the throat. I'm guessing with her hair, the ref didn't see it. And with that arm firmly tucked under the chin here, she is trying to just create some form of space here for herself as Danny B. But the Roe Nation starting to get behind Killa Kate. Oh. Now, Brittany, do you think that Danny B's former loss to Mia Friday is still weighing heavy on her as we see here into the cover. One, two, but a kick out. I definitely think she's maybe taking out her frustrations on Killa Kate right now and looking for a little submission of her own. Really working that shoulder. You know, I, I don't know how beneficial that'll be for her with somebody with as much training as Killa Kate has. It, it might actually bite her in the end. How smart is it to go after her arm for somebody that is such a good grappler, Shiva? You know, I, I, it just comes down to being smarter or being stronger. And in my opinion here, this is not a smart move by Danny B. We can see right here Killa Kate getting back up to a vertical base, using the arm to her advantage. And now oh. that jawbreaker manages to break free. The forearm gets blocked. Danny B lands one of her own. And now back elbow by Killa Kate. Oh no. Oh. She was thinking German suplex. But both these women. She's got her up. Oh. Their experience is. Oh, 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 look at that. Oh, oh my goodness. My soul just left my body. That I was out of Danny B. And Danny going over the corner trying to get a little pep top maybe for Jerry. Oh. This opening contest is definitely delivering as we still have the last stand rumble coming to you later tonight here, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this, Killa Kate on fire in that corner. Those kicks are brutal, and they may have just gotten her a victory as the shoulders are down, too, but a kick out from Danny B. This has been one intense battle so far, Kirby. An amazing battle as the Diamonds Division is looking for a new number one contender. Look at this. Oh! Oh, here you go one more time. That rear naked choke. This might be it. This might be it. And the thing is, she's been worn down a lot through this match. And when you can't breathe, you can't fight if you're able to stay conscious. Danny B fading. She could be completely out. The referee is making sure. But look oh, at did this. you see that? She got her foot on the rope. Cherry put her foot on the rope. Did you see that, Kirby? Uh, we're gonna have to get a replay. I could have sworn that Danny B got her foot on the rope. No. But it might have been Charity Kane that actually grabbed her foot and put it up there to force a rope break. Is not Charity Kane giving a pep talk here to Danny B? Oh, oh, oh! She got a pep talk herself of a boot in her face. Here we go, Danny up B. On up on the shoulders. Oh! oh. She stung her there. And oh she goes goodness. into the cover. And that's it for 